In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix ACPI BIOS error on Windows 11. So in case you're getting this error, so your computer just randomly blue screens, and then you can see this set emoji and it says your PC ran into a problem, it needs to restart and then some other information. And then over here at the very bottom where it says stop code next to the QR code, it says ACPI BIOS error, here's how you can fix it. Now, to make this clear for you for right off the bat, to fix this, usually you will just have to update your BIOS and that will not happen anymore. And I'm gonna show you how to do that depending on which manufacturer computer you are using. So the first option and the easiest option that we're gonna go to is you go to Google and type in the name of your manufacturer and then BIOS next to it. Now you can type BIOS or BIOS update or something along those lines. And then you wanna go to their website and then from here, you'll be able to see how to download their bio. So you'll get all the necessary documents and they will show you how to do it. So for me over here, for the Dell uh, computer, you can go to identify your product and then identify uh, or search your computer. So you can type in the name. So you can simply type in your serial number, model or product name, or maybe in service tag, you can detect your current computer by clicking over here. You can see recently viewed, etc. okay? So over here, let's say you wanna type in ROG because I know ROG is a computer if it's gonna find it right now. Okay, so it doesn't wanna find it. However, um, of course you have to put in your name of your computer and then it will find it for you. That's the first thing you can do. And then if you have a different computer, so let's say you have Lenovo, for example, or something like that, you just type in Lenovo BIOS update and you'll see their official support ticket over here. Go to the website, just read about it. Over here, as you can see, it will uh, essentially prompt you to identify your device and they will give you then the, the update and you'll be able to essentially download it and update your BIOS, or you can use the Lenovo system update app with Lenovo Vantage or whatever uh, you have on your computer if you're using Lenovo like me. And then you have different options. Of course, you just wanna go to Google, type in the manufacturer and then BIOS update, find your download file from their official website, download it, let that update, and then restart your computer. And hopefully this error will not be essentially occurring anymore on your computer. So that's pretty much it. I hope this video helped you out. And if it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.